Hello, uh, Bruce Sia again, Asia number one home based business coach, uh, sharing with you my video training. Uh, and also, uh, uh, today we're going to talk about the rules of the game what to do and what not to do. Just like uh, the traffic rules, you have your red, amber, green. Right? Red, do not hurt people. It's very clear. When you hurt people, you're hurting yourself. What goes around comes around in your business and your life. Always respect the most powerful law on earth, the universal law of cause and effect. What you sow, you shall reap. Amber stands for love, learn, leverage, and live your dream. And then green help many people to live a better life. So network marketing gives you the opportunity to help many people to live a better life. And uh, the rules is that. Uh, uh, like uh, Confucius said, don't do unto others what you don't want others to do unto you. Uh, reciprocity. When he was asked by a student, if there's only one rule to live by, what would that rule be? And he answered, reciprocity. Right? If you don't want others to do that to you, why do you want to do that to others? So, uh, simple, uh, basic common sense that uh, you play by the rules, you know, no betrayer, you know, there are some, they make their upline issue, uh, maybe the upline is new or the upline is facing some challenges and they want to uh, get a position uh, above the upline and this is definitely a no-no, not, not the right thing to do. And also uh, upline, uh, taking advantage of downline uh, by switching lines, you know, there's a lot of manipulation and uh, and it reflects uh, poor leadership, poor management and uh, and it's quite shocking to find that such things happen in these industries. So what do get around? And there's no secret. So 18 years I've seen the good, the bad and the ugly and uh, also the beautiful. So. Uh, Focus on the good and the beautiful. The ugly and the bad is in every industry, right? They, you always have the black sheep. So what you want to do is uh, teach your downline to do the right thing. That's why training is critical. So when we gather, we tell them these are the things we shouldn't do. Uh, always be grateful to your upline who share with you the opportunity, uh, whether he's incompetent or he's new or let's say he's, he's a drunkard or whatever you still can do the business you can work further up uh, he also has an upline that will be willing to help you but you don't go and change the lines it's just not the right thing to do it's like uh, changing father changing parents you know your parents has given you the gift of life so your upline has shared a wonderful opportunity with you so you should be grateful for that and it's all about gratitude, loyalty, relationship, trust. So once you break the trust, it's very hard to work together. So there must be harmony, there must be cooperation, and then there must be trust. So it's very important. And these are the fundamentals, these are the basics. Uh, what to do, what not to do, uh, should be taught at all, uh, all the trainings. And this is a part of the basic training. Yeah? that uh, we must always edify the upline, uh, work in harmony, cooperate with each other, sidelines, you know, and, uh, and not, not uh, be selfish, you see. The easiest way to fail, those who fail, is because they are selfish. I, me, myself, or they got a very big ego, right? The world revolves around them. So uh, these people usually they don't succeed in network marketing or if they do it's a short term right because uh, uh, it's about relationship people get to know you right so uh, we are here for the long term you got to build relationship and uh, tr training business opportunity presentation uh, you got to dress smart right and everybody plays a very important role you know, if you have guests and they see the people are dressing shabbily or, or, or not well, you know, 
it, it doesn't uh, make a good impression you never get a second chance to make the first impression so you got to dress smart and then uh, behave the right way at the business presentation uh, have your phone in the silent mode uh, don't talk while the speaker is talking presenting it's very irritating not only for the speaker but for the audience who are, who are listening and especially for the guests so uh, it, it just put yourself in those people who took a lot of effort to bring their guests and here you are making noise talking when you're not supposed to and distracting the guests and the speaker so this is what we call business opportunity presentation behavior so if I go to a business opportunity presentation and I hear a lot of talking noise I know that uh, the company lack training or the leaders are not training the people well so and then to sit well also to, to sit properly uh, not uh, fold your arms you know uh, be alert huh? so that uh, you increase the energy right? and to be attentive right? so uh, to participate uh, to volunteer uh, to clap right so all this is to create the energy oh, it plays a very important role and uh, if that night you don't happen to have a guest you still come and support your, your downline or also your sideline so the, the room is filled up right if you say, oh I don't have a guest and they're saying the same thing anyways every time the same you miss the point you don't really understand the business the business is about cooperating, it's about supporting your, your downline, your upline, your sideline, supporting the leaders and uh, and many times the speaker will say the same thing and it's not for you, it's for the guests, for new people, just like a teacher, they will, they will repeat the same thing over and over again. You don't expect the teacher to, to teach a different syllabus or a different subject, it's the same subject and it's repeated again and again. That's why they say repetition is the mother of all skills and a speaker, they have already honed the, their skill, they, they already uh, 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 time their delivery, everything. So you find that uh, it's very systematic and they will, they will repeat the same thing uh, exactly and uh, with the same enthusiasm. So uh, it's very interesting. Uh, I, I've listened to the same presentation 50 times, 100 times, but because I'm in the business, I know how it works. So you, it's just part of the business, you got to, to uh, participate and uh, support. What to do is uh, study the successful network marketers and I'll touch on the 8 money making activities. You got to do the 8 money making activities. And what not to do is, uh, uh, that means if you don't do the eight money making activities, you're not going to make money in network marketing. So that will be my next video. Uh, you see, uh, network marketing is about leadership. It's about leading by example. You got to be your own best customer. Uh, you got to be taking the products consistently. You can't tell people to do what you're not willing to do and uh, there's promotion, you support it and uh, all this you, you, you have to do so uh, I'll end here for this video and uh, I look forward to seeing you on the next video on the 8 money making activities so uh, love, learn, leverage and live your dream bye for now, take care